this is the greatest healer nature sunlight fresh air you can touch a tree you can touch a leaf as we said a while back there's a lot of narrative that push about healing and one thing we think people overlook and bypass is the constitution we have that is created perfectly and when we say created perfectly everything that was think about in your creation was think about before you were created or you would heal yourself and what are the ways now if you notice you have what we call a digestive system you have excretory system that means ways to come out you have a urinary tract system you have integumentary system that is your skin you all know the other two it's a reason why you have a rectum ways come out so in a nutshell what we are saying is that whenever you're sick whenever you're sick these three ways have to get active to remove toxins parasites waste mucus is a reason why you have them this when the sunlight catch it and you sweat or you exercise and you sweat so it's not all the while you're supposed to exercise in the ac because that is not the best thing to do now when i say enough guy you might exercise where i say don't do it all the while some of your exercise must go in the nature sunlight where the the the, the, the sun catch your skin and the the pores them hook them up and you start sweat sometimes when you look on your shirt you see it white that salt when you in the come out when the belly rumble when you have to purging we have to do you have to purge you go bathroom and you let out that large quantity of waste some of them old that has been in there from since you were a child you understand me the next thing you urinate these three ways is how you eliminate sickness i mean there's whole heap a medium that created no, if you have a God touch you or a person that the Almighty imbued him spirit into and him touch you, yes, you can be ill from infirmities too. That is reality. God, God sent holy up healers in many families, but that is when that God person touch you. You have temporary healing in you know? same thing like what your doctor would do is just give you a quick fix and you feel good but you have to know so you get a quick fix but seriously speaking i will say this already but we will say it again nature is the greatest healer you have to make sure that you defecate your urinate and your sweat this is all you get rid of Toxins, waste, plaque, mucus, mucoid matter, waste water, steel water. When you take them avenue, yeah, then you don't have to ask and worry yourself about getting rid of sickness. You will get rid of it. But people trying to look, where would I put it now? Let's say society. -ish. And so, them feel like it's wrong to go to the bathroom. See, people walk with them tissue and then hold it to them two fingers as if them scan it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you have to defecate. It's a must. That is why you have your excretory system. You ingest, you put something in your mouth to eat. Then you digest. And then you assimilate. Your food, most of the time, 
no in no pharma a metabolism no form of metabolism now take place from most people food because you can't digest beef or pork or goat or any other meat it just no break down to where you want it no in a break down right down to the state where it become liquefied so it's stuck just like we in Jamaica when we eat all of white flour we can't chew it to liquid you can't chew pork or beef or any other meat to liquid it just not going to work so now for my metamorphosis now go come to you caterpillar butterfly now go happen because you know break down the right characteristic as a matter of fact you never eat the right food for that take place so if your food for left from hard to soft in our world that no work because it's not get soft it on liquid form it can break down for the rest of the systems come to this the small intestine and take up that mineral content from that food and use it to help the rest of the body but in our world where we live now i can't tell most people eat that never take place that is why people are sick and the first place i would say 95 percent of every sickness starting your digestive system that is why the bible said do not let your gut become your god once you put yourself in this behavior where all of the food stuck down your song your belly start big i think you maybe have more um slimmer people in the world still more than fat people that is a reality but you still have more sick people so even people who are still slim them are by whole per parasitic agent you know and i like just come to eating 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 wrong more food should be incorporated more liquid that's the body can stay light and flow like the wind yes that is how it's supposed to be so we want to just put that little reality in a people brain that whenever you're sick these three ways defecation that when you got a bathroom go defecate urination that when you pee pee and your sweat skin push out the wastewater them three ways eh? once these things happening you will get rid of sickness and i'm not more for say a man can prove me wrong but we know that's the reality that's the truth bless upon yourself